I'm Trisha Swenson, and these are your weekend picks. Happy fall, everybody. We've got a lot of things going on up and down the valley. I'm here at Beaver Creek where they're celebrating their Epicurean adventure. Now, food and wine and spirits events are nothing new to Beaver Creek, but this is a brand new event and a new time of year for it as well. They thought they would capitalize on everything that we have to offer with the fall colors starting to occur and just a great time of year to be here. So everything from farm to table dinners to grand tastings, you're gonna have it all and they're utilizing a lot of the activities that we do here in the summertime. So the choose your own adventure. You can either hike, horseback ride, or take a 4x4 Jeep tour to Bino's Cabin, which is nestled right between Grouse Mountain and Larkspur Bowl. And they're gonna take you to a gourmet lunch. Chef McKenzie Nicholson has been working hard to come up with a great buffet spread for you. And then some great cocktails for you as well. So that is gonna be on Saturday. Then Saturday night, we've got the Grand Tasting and a new location for that this year. That's going to be up at Spruce Saddle. So you will take the Centennial Lift up there. And then from 6 to 9, they're going to have all sorts of great food samples that you can try from different Beaver Creek restaurants. And they are going to be having the Royal Street Ramblers play some live music. We'll have spirits there. So a little bit of whiskey, a little bit of wine, and great craft cocktails. So check that out. That is the Epicurean Adventure. Go to beavercreek.com forward slash signature events to get your tickets and to find out more. And then we also have some walks and hikes for charity this weekend. On Saturday, we have the Rocky Mountain Walk to End Alzheimer's. And this will take place down at Brush Creek Park in Eagle. And registration starts at 9, 10 o'clock. It will be a short program. And then they're going to have you go on about a two mile walk. And it's stroller friendly, wheelchair friendly. Uh, wagon friendly bring the dogs as well and wear your purple it's gonna be a, a great a walk to end Alzheimer's and then over in Vail they have the climate for climate and that is brought to you by the Walking Mountains Science Center it's a benefit and they want to celebrate sustainability bring people together educate them so you'll start at the base of the Eagle Bond gondola and you have your choice of taking the gondola up or you can hike berry picker and along the way they're gonna have musicians and different action stations that'll help you just learn a little bit more about the topic of sustainability and once you get to the top they're gonna to have food wine beer and more live music runaway grooms will be playing a special performance right there at Eagles Nest so for more information on that you can go to walkingmountains.org and then we have a huge benefit for the schools of Eagle County it's called the Wild West Day it's been going on for 33 years and and it's when all the schools come together, they put all their efforts towards fundraising, They've got a great auction, silent auction. They've got all the fun and games that you're gonna find out at Four Eagle Ranch. Very affordable, it's just $8 per person. Parents, kids, grandparents, even if you don't have kids, come on out to Four Eagle Ranch. It's gonna be a great day of fun at Wild West Day. And then wanna remind you, we have one more weekend of Beaver Creek Lift service. So on Sunday, we're closing it. Centennial Lift will be closed all the way until opening day. And that is gonna be the day before Thanksgiving Thanksgiving here at the Beeve, but we do still have Vail open. So this Friday, Saturday and Sunday, we'll have Vail open for you, Gandhi One, as well as the Eagle Bond Gondola, number 19. And then next weekend, Vail will be open for you as well, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sunday. And then they'll close down until their opening date for the 2023-2024 season on November 10th. So the leaves are just starting to turn here up in the high country. So come out and enjoy it. It's going to be a great weekend. That's a look at your weekend picks. If you want to find out what's going on throughout the Vale Valley, you can tune in to Vale Valley Live on YouTube and Facebook and on Channel 17 Comcast Xfinity Outside Watch.